Thank you. On the hottest days throughout the season, you'll want to protect your phone from the summer heat. So we're bringing in an expert for this. We've got Adam Komalov here from Fix Phone, located inside Haywood Mall. Welcome. Thanks yeah. for coming in. Thank you. Um, wanted to pick your brain because most of us are pretty conscious about, you know, keep your phone away from the water, don't drop it in. But really the risk is the heat poses a big problem. What's the problem with heat and phones? Yeah, the phones has a battery, of course. So in the heat, the battery can make uh, a lot of problem mm -hmm. when it's get more than like 120 degree over it. So that's why we recommend to keep it on the cool or yep. not leave it in the hot places. Yeah, we don't want to drain our batteries and that's the, yeah, the short course. lifespan that happens. So you provided some tips for us. Uh, first you say, try not to use your devices while charging them. That's that's real, when you charge it, walk away from it. Why, why is that? Yeah, because when you use your phone uh, while it's charging, uh, it makes more gives the more hot mm -hmm. on, the, on the phone, so that's why it keeps uh, drain the battery, of course, and uh, of course on the life uh, lifetime of the battery. Okay, and yeah, so you just want to keep your phone kicking as long as it can, so you've got to take good care of it, keep it out of that heat, and then obviously you don't want to leave it in your car. What can happen? I mean, if you leave your car, leave your phone in there, and you're, it's a couple hundred, it's a hundred degrees, what happens? <laughs> yeah, the mostly uh, when you leave the car in the on the sun, so the degree on there can go up to 120 in a one hour of only. Uh -huh. So uh, when you leave the phone inside of it, so of course uh, it gonna damage the battery. It can damage the every all parts in, in it. Okay. So that's why I would not recommend it. Yeah. Keep nobody, it in it. nobody would forget their phone that long anyway. Of we don't feel the twitch, <laughs> I guess, to go back and find it. But uh, you may be out in the sun, and there's an outlet. Maybe you have got the ability to charge while you're out there. But you say even if there's a place to plug in your phone, you don't want to charge it in the sun at all, right? Yeah. The directly sunlight, mm -hmm. if it goes to the phone, of course, it's gonna affect on the uh, circulation of the battery and the charging on it. So that's why. We not recommend it to leave it, okay. especially in the sunlight. And then we've been in that situation. You're out there with friends. Even, your phone might be in the shade even, but then all of a sudden you're getting that alert that the phone is overheating, it's too hot. What do you do to cool your phone down? The, some people like uh, try to put it in the fridge or like uh, somewhere in the cold. But don't so do that. Don't do that because the rapid cha temperature changing may mm -hmm. cause like a, a big problems. Uh, especially like the uh, microchips in the phones that uh, when you change the rapid uh, temperature in it, it, they might cause the big uh, issues. After that, you need to replace the whole phone. <laughs> you get some people coming in with some questions about yes, what they've done with course, their phone, I bet. Um, all right, so don't, don't throw it in the fridge or the freezer. Um, you also encourage people to turn off any applications. Turn off the apps, turn off the features that you're not using. Uh, those keep running, right? Yeah, of course. Most people uh, come to us too with the problems that the, the battery is draining so fast. So we recommend that people that if you want to keep the battery life longer, so don't uh, turn off the, all the features that you mm -hmm. don't use, like a Bluetooth ones or the Wi-Fi when you don't use it, or some other features that phones has that. So we recommend to not use them if you want to keep the battery uh, life yep. longer. Yep. Turn off all those things you're not using. And then you say overall it's important to give your phone a break. Everything needs a break. No matter how important you are or how busy you are, there just needs to be time for your phone to be alone from you. Yeah. <laughs> Mostly we have the problems with that kind of stuff, the gamers, like uh, when you use the game or like uh, call a lot of, so the phone get in high performance of it, so that's yeah. why it's going to use the all power of it. So then uh, we recommend to leave the phone somewhere in the not hot, not cold place, at least like a 30 minutes to keep the phone yeah. in a better condition. It's not meant to keep running the whole time. You've got yes. to give it its honest break. Um, at Fix Phones, you fix phones and tablets and gadgets. Um, yeah, anything you want people to know about the, the service you provide or what it's like to walk into your store? Yeah, we have uh, all kind of uh, services, mm -hmm. like uh, tablets, all electronic devices, let's say. Anything we can mess up, you can try to fix. And I'm sure you yeah. hear <laughs> stories all the time about what people have done with their technology and, yeah, and they just need Yeah, right help. now, like uh, in the summertime, we have a lot of customers with the water damage problems, yeah. of course, and especially with the broken screens and yeah. all that stuff. Any quick tips on that? You're not supposed to drop into a bag of rice, or you are? No. It's not going to affect on that. Okay, good. Well, we'll th there are other questions people will <laughs> ask you at Fix Phone located in Haywood Mall, 700 yeah. Haywood Road in Greenville. Open 10 a.m. 
Monday through Saturday and open at noon on Sunday. Sure.